Montgomery County now have announced a big drug bust. More than a million dollars worth of marijuana is now off the street. So far, four people are under arrest and in custody. Anne Marie Green is live in Conshohocken with all the details on this. Anne Marie? Well, Mark, the suspects believe they were in business with Pennsylvania drug dealers. So not only did they deliver the stash to police, they delivered themselves. What you see oftentimes are uh, trucks like this stopped at the border uh, or stopped along the turnpike and then just randomly searched or things of that nature. Um, it's very rare to have a hand-to-hand -hand buy. Indeed, the suspects handed their illegal cargo right into the hands of undercover officers, delivering it in a tractor trailer filled with, of all things, high-end vacuum cleaners. The high-end vacuum cleaners were actually on their way to a legitimate retailer. The driver stopped along the way to pick up the extra cargo. Police pretended to be big-time Pennsylvania drug dealers setting up a warehouse near the Conshohocken train station and promising the dealers $550,000 for the stash. I have to tell you, I swallowed very hard when I signed a check for in excess of $100,000 for the bank to give to us so that we would have the cash if we needed to flash it. The money never changed hands. Officers waiting in the wings descended on the warehouse as the suspects unloaded the trailer. The detectives told me that the that the men were completely frozen in place when they saw the, the number of uh, armed and very determined police officers that were there. Charged is the alleged driver Manuel Grande and three other suspects, Sergio Navea, Hedy Loya and Abby Rodriguez. Now, police believe the tractor trailer came from Mexico, drove cross country. Three of the suspects actually flew in special from Chicago to make sure that the deal went off without a hitch. Live from Conshohocken, I'm Anne Marie Green for CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Anne Marie, thank